So Casey and I met right around Christmas time 2016. We instantly hit it off, and we also discovered that we had a shared love of hunting. <laughs> I had been gun hunting since the age of 12, so I had quite a few years under my belt. I had always been interested in bow hunting, so I was really excited to give it a try. We spent the entire winter 2017 exploring and scouting, looking for new places to hunt for the upcoming season. As spring rolled around, we spent majority of our free time working out and shooting our bows in preparation for my first season of bow hunting. jacked up. We got in really late. It was already getting light. We were super loud. Super loud setting up. The whole thing was just a mess. We got busted by a deer while it was just gray light while we were still setting up. I think I should just skip hunting opening morning, I guess. <laughs> This is our fourth sit this year. We have yet to see a single deer. When I get back here, and everything is super grown over from the winter, I'm, I'm not even gonna be able to get a shot off unless the deer's five friggin' feet away from me. Shoot her when you're ready. Ma'am. Nice job. That's hard. She's done. Good job. There's truly no feeling like shooting your first deer with a bow. Needless to say, after this hunt, I was completely addicted.
got south, southeast wind, which is perfect for the spot that we wanted to hunt. Um, on the way here, we had some truck issues with the brakes. We didn't know for sure if we were gonna go out or not, but we decided just to go out. Because <laughs> why wouldn't we? Hey Casey, it's time to go hunting. So I'm super excited to get in here. It's only one o'clock. We're getting in nice and early. It's about a two and a half mile kayak ride down this river. Um, me and Casey are heading in there, but I have extremely high hopes. It's kind of uh, cold, cloudy. It's a good day. I think it's, I think it's gonna be a kill night. And we need to see something. We have been on a rough streak like I've never had in my entire life before. Uh, I'm at nine or 10 sits without seeing any bucks. And, and four does in nine sits, so it's definitely my worst start to a season ever. It's been raining for the last hour and a half basically since I got set up, which I knew it was going to. And of course I forgot my rain gear or any sort of jacket, so now I'm freezing my balls off and wet. But whatever. So, uh... Well, it just sucked, and then we just had to pat, or paddle two miles back against the current. And now we're wet, and we're cold, and we didn't see anything, so... are wet. 
Schneider what? He doesn't know what he's talking about. Shoot a deer already, damn it. I'm trying. We had some of the best blood on this buck that I've ever seen on an archery hit deer. We followed this buck down ravines, across rivers. Uh, we looked for him all that night. When we were unable to find him, we came back the next morning and we actually kicked him live out of a bed over two miles from the initial point of impact. I have no idea if he wound up living or if he ended up dying, but all I know is we looked the entire next day and found basically no trace of him after kicking him up alive. And the funny thing about bow hunting is we put thousands of miles on the truck, we put hundreds of miles on our boots, and in the end, a lot of the times, the difference between success and failure ends up coming down to just an inch or two. But I can tell you what, we're gonna come back next season more prepared, we're going to do more scouting, more shooting, and we're going to find more success in 2018.